Hi guys, so this week Councillor from Blackpool had some advice for those who wanted to visit the area and take advantage of the good weather. The advice was, enjoy the beach, just don't get into the water. So the water company United Utilities issued a statement that due to heavy rain, they had to release raw sewage into the sea. This means tourist sites and fishing communities are once again suffering the consequences of what may be underinvestment in water treatment. But the way the councillor talks about this problem is something to be concerned about. Have a listen. Well, you can still enjoy the beach, and you can still enjoy the beach, the promenade, the piers, just don't go in for a paddle. That's the advisory notice that's been issued by United Utilities. So it's, it's advisory notice. We've got notices up along the promenade, social media. Um, you know, we've done as much as we can in a, in a very short turnaround to inform people of that advisory notice. When would the advice become more like an order, if you like, to say just don't get in the water, it's not safe? Well, the initial, you know, all the tests so far show that there's been minimal uh, impacts on the water, so we're hoping further tests today. Um, you know, there was an awful, awful amount of water, as you've just said, which will have diluted. Um, there will have been some. It, it wasn't properly treated, obviously, the sewage. But um, so we're hoping that, and when it was released, hopefully it was at high tide. It's taken it out. So you know, further tests today, which again will concur that you know there's been minimal impact on the waters. People were paddling in this water yesterday. What would your message be to anybody who fancies a day out to the beach here in Lancashire? Come down to the beach. Come and enjoy the beach, you know, and enjoy Blackpool Prom in all its glory, the piers, everything else. But just don't have a paddle just for the time being. Um, and, and hopefully uh, we'll have a short turnaround and we can let everybody know that it's actually safe to go back in these, you know, in the beautiful sea again. Yeah, it would be hard. Oh my goodness. Okay. Uh, look, I, I almost feel for this councillor because she's probably under a lot of pressure to convince people to spend money in the town to come down to the beach. But she knows that it's not safe for people to, to go swimming in the water or to paddle in the water. Now, I believe that councils and communities around Britain should be taking legal action against these water companies. How many millions of pounds, <clears throat> excuse me, how many millions of pounds have been lost in revenue for communities during summer, during this period? The, you know, how many businesses are losing money, um, hotels, hospitality, restaurants, all, all sorts of businesses, all, and also the fishing communities? How much money is being lost because these water companies are not doing their job, are deciding, well, you know, when things get a little bit tough, we'll just pump raw sewage into the sea. It becomes somebody else's problem. And I think councils should be putting more pressure, or whatever pressure they can, on these water companies. But of course, it has to come from central government. The Minister for the Environment should be putting pressure on these water companies, should be issuing larger fines. And if not, that's not the case, they should be dragging these people before a judge, before a court. Because it's completely unacceptable. Businesses are losing money over this. The ecosystem is being destroyed over this. And who's, who's benefiting? Well, the water companies and their shareholders. The Tories are talking about investing another 1.6 billion in, this, in these water companies. But what are they going to do with that money? They're going to shovel it into the pockets of their shareholders. They're not going to spend it on upgrading the system or whatever they do they'll also ask the bill payers to help compensate any uh, reconstruction as well absolutely unacceptable let me know in the comment section guys what you think as always your comments are greatly appreciated thanks a lot